Though the summer heat is subsiding, we are not finished with the threat of wildfires, and we want you to be prepared. Our first alert five weather team is tracking the potential for fire danger on Thursday. Meteorologist Lauren Brand explains why we'll be seeing these conditions. A low pressure system off to our west will bring in rain chances until Wednesday, but once we get to Thursday, we will see dry and gusty conditions. The winds will be coming out of the west, which will give us down sloping winds. When wind flows over the mountains, the air will start to warm up because of the increase of pressure. Areas directly in the path of these winds could see gusty conditions and warmer temperatures. This will increase the risk of fires. The National Weather Service will sometimes issue fire weather watches or red flag warnings. Fire weather watches are usually issued when critical fire conditions are possible within the next 24 to 96 hours. Red flag warnings are usually issued when these conditions are likely within the next 12 to 48 hours. With red flag warnings specifically, we will look for strong winds, low relative humidity values, and dry fuels like grasses or vegetation. In these conditions, fires can catch easily and they can spread quickly. The last time we had a red flag warning in southeastern Colorado was July 14th, and it was only for Teller County. The springs in Pueblo were not included in this. When we look at the month of September, Southern Colorado averages 1.8 of red flag warnings. March through June is when we see the most amount of red flag warnings issued, and it will start to see a decrease in July from the monsoonal moisture. Once we get into the fall months and we start to see a decrease in monsoonal moisture, red flag warnings become a little bit more common. We are likely to see a jump in the number of red flag warnings within the next few months. The average for October is 5.2. If a fire weather watch or a red flag warning is issued, take preventative measures to make sure you don't create any sparks. Don't park your cars on grass and use caution while grilling. Don't throw any cigarette butts out of your window. Meteorologist Lauren Brand, News 5.